Hello, my name is Pavra, and here's another talk for the day on ritual. So ritual provides a bridge between confusion and certainty. It provides a bridge between the confusion and the sincerity of our, our present situation and the confidence and certainty in the Buddha as a teacher of the truth. Ritual is the physical expression of the ideals of our heart. It gives, gives shape to the highest desires of our heart. Ritual builds a confidence in the Buddha, his golden light of truth, and the passing on of the bright lamp of freedom. The repetitious nature of ritual is a dance of freedom. The imagination is ignited by the colours, words and gestures, by candlelight and ghostly fragrant movement of incense. Ritual gives shape and sound to our true heart's desire. True ritual, we call on the Buddha and Bodhisattvas to be present within our four walls, to take their seat upon our shrines, to sit serenely smiling and radiating the luminosity of the free mind. And presence breeds confidence, and confidence breeds action, and action gives birth to transformation. Ritual is a golden doorway to freedom, a dam or door to the yogi's cave, or a golden gateway <coughs> to the Bodhi tree. When we do the simple ritual of saluting the shrine, we invoke the three jewels. We call on them to be present on the shrine and in our hearts. Gradually, the chamber of our hearts become, becomes a living shrine, radiant with the golden light of the Buddha, the deep sapphire light of the Dharma, and the ruby red light of the Sangha. And when our hearts and minds are blessed by the three jewels, fear and confusion are dispelled, and we can face confidently into our day. Namo Buddhaya, Namo Dharmaya, Namo Sanghaya.